Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video is another um, reveal in my group swap. This one comes from Strawberry May. Okay, there is her name, Melissa, and she made one for me, so thank you so much for making one for me. And I already took a look at her card so I could read the message but look at how gorgeous this card is so pretty I love the flower the paper in the background and she said she used um, what was it a Park Lane paper pad fresh air by Park Lane and it's so pretty and I love the yellow and mint teal mixture and she's got this pretty ribbon um, tied onto both of the straps on this clear bag so cute <clears throat> and they all look like this I'm just gonna untie this so I can get into the bag I don't want to like rip it or anything I'm going to take everything out because I have to show you these lemons that are in, he <clears throat> in here. And this cool, this is what she used for paper shred. They're like scraps of the paper, it looks like. So cute. And then she added these little lemons. How cute. I can save those and use that for a fruit theme swap. So cute. I love it. So let's take a look at everything that she sent. So the first thing that I'm seeing is some lemon heads, which I am so excited about because I love lemon heads. And she just put a little belly band with a rosette and some tulle. It's so pretty. Love that. And then here are her flowers. Look at this bag topper. I love this butterfly. There's the like pretty floral accent. She's used stickles for the centers. That tool, I really like this tool. I would love to get some of that. Bring May flowers. Is that a stamp? That's so cute. And the little diamond dots. And then look at her flowers. These are so pretty. I really like these ones. I've been loving um, I love layered up flowers, but for some reason I've been really loving like simple, just the really super simple like flat flowers like this one from the KS Craft um, tote that was from the March release. I just really love, I don't know what it is, um, but I've been obsessed with that. But look at these ones, the layered up ones with the pretty pearls in the center. These are so gorgeous, and I'm just loving this pink and mint or teal colors mixed together. So, so pretty. And then her seed packet. So, and there's little punch outs of butterflies and flowers all over, too. So, this is how she is decorated. We got one that's stuck to the Velcro. That's okay, I'll fix that off camera. So look at this umbrella. I am obsessed. This is so cute. What die is this? Or is this a cut file? I really, there's a few dies that I just had on my wish list and an umbrella is one of them. And then we have April showers. So cute. And she's used Velcro. I'll fix that one off camera. And look at how cute. It's a little lemon slice with some flowers. And in here are her die cuts. <gasps> There's an umbrella in here. Oh, goodness. I'm so excited. Okay, let's see what these die cuts look like. It looks like there's some leaves and the lemon slices. So cute. An umbrella with the layering pieces. And there's the little handle here. Ooh. Well, there it is. 
And then look at the lemons. I can paper piece the slices on. And then all the leaves. So cute. I love that. Those are so pretty. Oh gosh. I'm trying to throw them everywhere. Okay. So the next one. Ooh, this one is a, like a rhinestone lemon. Really cute. And in here. Ooh, this is her sequin mix. So she's put a die cut lemon on top. And then look at this mix. Tons of diamond dots. There's some like of the sequins with the no hole in them. There's flowers. There's little lemon slices. There's tiny flowers. This is gorgeous. I love this. So, so pretty. Put that back in there. Then the next one, she's done a little eyelet with a dangle of a lemon slice. I'm just loving this lemon theme. It's so cute. And inside is her shaker. Oh, look at this. Like a, is that like a martini? Not a martini. Like a daiquiri? I don't know. I don't really drink, so. <laughs> um, this will just say is a nice lemonade. With the cutest slices that she's even done like ink on there to add more like dimension to it and it's clear all the way through this gorgeous butterfly this is so cute i love that and then in her last one here we've got another lemon up top she's added some of the like white gel pen to like make it shiny and inside here oh my gosh look at this so she shared a flower die super cute and then there's this little cloud how cute they're nesting cloud dies that is adorable thank you that's so sweet and make sure there isn't more die cuts. Okay, so in here she shared a couple of die cuts that's the vellum on, or the colored cardstock on top of vellum, which I really love. Hello Sunshine and You're So Sweet. These are so cute. I love this. And those are like individual letters, so that that's a lot of work to do the individual letters and lining them up properly. That's hard. This is such a cute swap. I am obsessed. So that is everything that is sent by Strawberry May. Let me show you her name again. Oh, it's on the bag. Okay. Strawberry May 1400 on Instagram. So thank you so much. I called you Melissa. It says Melinda. I can read. <laughs> Sometimes. So thank you so much, Melinda. Thank you for sending one to me. And I will be right back with the next one. Okay, so this next one comes from Gina. Um, she is um, she contacted me through email. She doesn't do YouTube or anything. So um, unfortunately, we can't follow her to see all of her beautiful creations. But that's okay. Um, but this is how hers comes. Look at how beautiful. She said they're all pretty similar, and she made one for me. So thank you so much, Gina, for making one for me. And we will get right into it. So right here on the back, she has something taped to the bag. There's going to be some crinkling while I get this open. bag off and we'll get this little tote out okay so we will go ahead and look at this little envelope she had on the back cute little envelope with the pretty colors and then this dangle off of it it has her email um, looks like her birthday is September 20th. She likes clean and simple and mint pink and gold. 
definitely right up my alley mint pink and gold and look at this cute like tag that she made the heart with the rolled flowers kindness is magic there's this pretty like mesh in the background and then the little dangle that says spring so cute and inside here there's lots of goodies oh my goodness okay so she said in her note that she wanted to do something different so she made a seed bead mix that we can put in our um, sequins and this is so pretty I love the colors very springy there's yellows and golds and blues and that is a lot of seed beads so that's so cute thank you so much and then look at this we've got some little smiley faces we got this butterfly it's like a little bag of charms there's some enamel dots in there we got keys this cute daisy dropping something we got the pretty little butterfly the little birdie these are so pretty that's the one i dropped set those over here and then in here there's some cabochons so there's tiny little bows this beautiful butterfly the cute bunny with the flowers on it and then these little bows here so cute and then look at these cabochons all the flowers Ooh, these are so pretty oh i love those thank you so much that's so sweet to send extras and then in here this is so cute so there's twine and then there's little like banner pieces to make like the tiniest little banner or use them as tags those are so cute love that love 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 and she's used a little bit of tape to hold them together and then here is her tote so that there's a bunch of shred to protect everything and it's such a pretty mix i love i love 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 all the colors together and she has done way more than the requirements which is totally fine so where do we start let's pull from the back here so we got another one of these envelopes and we got a little paper clip with um the pom-pom on top this pretty flower and then the pretty ribbon wrapped around it so cute and inside here oh look at how beautiful this is so she's made a window shaker totally embellished let's pull this out um and she's used diamond dots as the shaker mix that is so cute i like to do that sometimes too um like just using diamond dots to do as a shaker mix in the shakers well, look at how pretty this is i love this birdie in the background the inked up flower there's even some like um like nouveau drops in here this is so cute i love love that and there's a pretty mix inside the bag that was holding the shaker gotta save all of that okay then the next thing here We'll look at her tote once I pull everything out so we can take a better look at inside the tote. Look at these embellishments. These are like banners that she's put on the straws. And then this cute little simple bag topper that I absolutely love. I love this flower. That's cute. And then look at her layering. Ooh, that ribbon in the background. Ooh, that ribbon. Ooh, I need some of that. Where'd you find that? <laughs> That's so pretty. It's like iridescent. And then there's a whole bunch of sequin mix that I will definitely be saving at the bottom. The rolled flowers. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. All the layering. All the colors. It's so beautiful. And then look at this. So she's done a little clip. And this cute little bag topper. We got tickets in the background. And then 
the flowers and a pom-pom, a little puffy sticker, and I'm going to take that off so I can show the butterflies. Let's actually pull them out because the butterflies, one of them has a dangle. So we got to see it. See the dangle. Okay. So see here, this butterfly down here, it's got a little beaded dangle. Don't forget to fly. She's done the like fringe in the background, the enamel dots, there's flowers. These are just layered up and gorgeous. And of course the colors are stunning. So pretty. And then next here we have die cuts. Oh, let's see if my dogs are gonna start flipping out. Okay. So we've got this cute little um, paper clothespin here and her pretty bag topper with the giant layered up flower that's all inked up. That's so pretty. Love that on the doily. So cute. And there are lots of die cuts here. So I see some rolled flowers. Where are we at? Okay, look at these. I think these are like those Tim Holtz, um, like 3D um, emboss it die cut things. I have one that does a frame. Ooh, the birdie and the little birdie. Couple tags that she's already added the string on for us. Some frames. We've got the scallop circle and some rolled flowers. and sequins in every bag and then in this one there's some more frames there's this piece ooh the umbrella y'all know I'm obsessed with the umbrella this layered flower and the little rain boots so pretty that's so many die cuts that's so much work so thank you so much that's so sweet and then oh my gosh look at her flowers so she's used one of these um, at the top these hearts that she gifted us, the leaves, the rolled flower, and then the pom-pom trim, and then look at these flowers. And she's done inking on all of them. That is so much work. Wow, these are so beautiful. I don't think I could ever use them because they're just so pretty. So gorgeous. And then we've got her seed packet. And we'll take a look at her tote here in a minute. We'll go through this and then I'll show her tote off. Oh, the sequin mix. I was not careful. It went everywhere. Okay. Look at how pretty this is. Ooh, she's used more of that really pretty yellow trim here. And there's little layered up flowers in the background. She's used some like tassel trim that kind of looks like grass at the bottom, the leaves, the big pretty ribbon bow, it's velcro closure, and she's decorated each one. So cute, love the layering, the little flowers, and inside here, oh my gosh, she's gifted some flower dyes. Look at how pretty these are. Wow, that's so sweet. Thank you so much, Gina. I'm actually, I'm going to just set that aside. Oh, and then look at this. So we got this floral background, some gold dots, this bunny, the heart. And in here is her sequin mix. Look at how pretty that is. I'm going to probably, it looks like, all of this extra mixture is also what was in the sequin mix, so I'm going to add it all together. The flowers, there's little polymer pieces, there's seed beads. This is so pretty. All the pretty springy colors. And then here we've got the little butterfly in pursuit of magic. Tiny little layered flowers. 
And this is her shaker. Oh my goodness, a little bird house. That's so cute. She's added the leaves, the little bird, and then an acrylic, like a flower cabochon to it. That's so cute. And then this last one here, she's done the little bird, a circle, the leaves, radiate positivity, and then the little flowers. I really love the, uh, the little flowers. And holy cow, there's more die cuts. The work you have done, that's so sweet. And I just love the colors and the papers. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. So let's look at the die cuts. Well, we've got some leaves here. If I can... Okay. We got these pretty leaves. You can always use leaf die cuts. We've got a couple birdies. This pretty doily. And then the cute little birdhouse. How cute is all of this? And then, to top it all off, we have this amazing tote that she's made. That is so pretty. I just love this bundle of flowers that she's done in the front. She's used flower brads to attach the straps. This is so pretty. And she made three of them, so... The work that she put in for all of this is so sweet. So thank you so much, Gina. I'm really happy that you joined my swap. Thank you for sending one for me. And that is all I have to share with you. But stay tuned because there's still more rolling in. So until next time, happy crafting.